Hi guys, it's Joe. So I wanted to share with you my August projects and all the links to the pro uh, the products that I use will be on my blog so it will be in the description box below and uh, if you have any questions just type it in the comment section and I'll try to answer them. Okay, so the first uh, stamp set that I used it is from Avocado Arts and it's called You Can Do It so it's like a school themed stamp set and that's what it looks like so I made three cards or three projects out of this so here is the first one I made it into I made a baby boy card and it looks like this and the stamps that I used are the UR right here and the number one and the uh, die cut is from the greeting farm so that is one card right there the second card I used the die that I used for this one is the stitched gift card pocket die and it's from my creative time so I used that and I made like a little gift card holder in the front the uh, stamp that I used is you can do it which is the one down here and I just use a embossing folder on craft paper the pencils here is this one right here that I just paper pieced and lightly colored the uh, top of the pencil and I did it three times and then I just paper pieced it with a pattern paper so that's what it looks like added some twine and button and that's it okay and then the last one is this cute little box and I used the one smart cookie so it looks like this and this uh, box is from this die is from Sizzix and I just did a rosette, a little banner, and then colored the cookies, added a bow. Uh, if you open this up, I already ate the cookie, but it looks like this. And it has a, I put acetate on there. And you just slide the cookie in or whatever treat. And put the ribbon back, and that's what it looks like. Cute little treat box. So those are the projects that I made with using this stamp set. Okay. The next one is, I didn't do a blog post on this one, I just made it a while back, but I used the Mama Elephant dies, and this girl is from Some Odd Girl Stamps, and I colored it with my Copics, and then I paper pieced her sweater there. She's sitting on some Rolling Hills grass that I used the uh, Landscape Trio from Mama Elephant and it has stitching so it looks really nice and then um, for the word bubble I use I think this is a speech bubbles trio and I use the one that looks like a cloud right there and this uh, stamp image is from Avocado Arts and then I had some faces stamps and I just put it on the on the sun and that's what it looks like I just popped up a lot of the elements so those are this is using the mama elephant dies then let's see what else okay so the next projects I use the jelly bean soup and this is the Halloween stew this is the Halloween papers and then I use the coordinating pea pod parts from Jelly Bean Soup. And then I use the stamp set uh, Darcy's Heart and Home. And this is the the Halloween set. So I got all this here from Seven Kids College Fund. And then also I use the pillow box punch board. So let me show you uh, the card first this is I'll be your pumpkin punking forever I just added some sequence in that paper is from the jelly bean soup colored the owl with my Copics and then I use uh, this is lawn fawn chit chat dies 
and then that's the sentiment in the stamp set and then I just drew some lines around the border so that's that and then for the um, pillow bun pillow punch board I did a lot of pillow boxes and let's let me get them so here they are and I did a video on this as well so I'll put the link of that video in the description box and I use a bunch of the die cuts also and then here is just a simple one that I doodled the spider web first and then I sampled the box so there's that and then some more pillow boxes I did like treat ba uh, favors and this one says happy birthday just did a rosette and a banner and then this one says thank you really cool really easy to make and then lastly this is my I'm Roses project I did a video on this as well and it'll be in the description box and I did a top hat I did a mini tutorial on how I assembled the top hat and that's what it looks like some gears some I'm Roses flowers a wood veneer leaves and there's my little heart and some sprockets gears so that's the top hat okay so those are my projects that I created for the month of August and thanks for watching see you soon bye